Welcome back to the This week's identity is race. And here's your host, Shannon. good at this. I'm really good at like sensing things. I'm basically psychic. Well, that doesn't matter. I'm so cultured. I know about all different races. This game is so in the bag. Let's do this. Um, yeah, whatever you say. Now help me welcome the first model to the stage. Remember now, you get only one chance to guess and one lifeline to use. Hmm. Okay, let me get a good look at you. Spin around for me, darling. All right. Well, you got that milk chocolate skin. You look a little exotic. And you got that thick curved body. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with maybe black. <laughs> Are you sure that's your final answer, there, Nick? All right, you know, I'm not 100%, so I think I will use one of my lifelines. All right, you have three options for the lifelines. Option one is see the parents. Option two is 50-50, where we'll give you multiple options of races. And option three is the wild card. Ooh, I'm going to do the wild card. All right, for the wild card, you can touch the model's hair and get a good feel for the best guess. <laughs> oh, this will be perfect. This will definitely confirm my guess. OK, so let's see here. It's soft, but I mean, it's a little coarse, and then it's, it's pretty thick, but pretty well straightened, too. You know, I think this model's trying to confuse us with this. Uh, you got 30 seconds to go, come on. Oh, okay, okay. Um, well, I do see some curly roots there that you're trying to hide, but you're not gonna fool me. I'm gonna go with my original guess, black. And that is wrong. Well, this one's pretty easy. You're white. OK, now, now, you saw how Nick's situation went over there. Is that your final answer? You know, I feel like I'm right, but I do have that lifeline, so I might as well use it. Give me the 50-50 option, please. OK, let's throw some options on the board now. And now let's take away half of them and see what we got. You know, it's like I said before. You're obviously white. And <laughs> once again, that is wrong. Let's bring up AJ now. Okay, so far our contestants have failed to truly uncover what they see. AJ, can you be the one to name that race? I'll try my best. All right, can we bring out our third and final model, please? Hmm. I don't want to take any chances on this, so I'll use one of my lifelines. Show me your parents. Let's see that throwback photo up here. Aww. Is this a joke? I don't get this. Your time's almost up. Come on, I need an answer. I only see one race. That's the way it should be. All right, well, you are all eliminated. <laughs> Have a good night. Models? Now, what do you think of this? I am multiracial. I am more than two races. 
I am biracial. I identify as two races, but you only see me as one. And I am transracial. I got this from Columbia by two loving parents who do not share my culture. I am a race that is often ignored, overlooked, to make life simpler for those of monoracial privilege. But insignificant is not me. My culture is, consists of so much within my race. And what you see is just the tip of the iceberg. I always have to force and prove who I am and prove my other side. You're positive I'm only what you see on my exterior. I am both privileged and oppressed. I am so much more than the labels you give me. You call me whitewashed, but you don't understand my life. You embrace your family and learn your family's culture, so what's the big deal when I do that with mine? We are here. So please, think before you ask the question of, what are you? We are not a game piece for, success, for society to dictate what we choose. Because these are our identities that you're 